Okay, you're in Microsoft Excel and you want to perform a count of unique records within a pivot table. So here's my scenario. I've got various people playing these four games and you can see here that Babs has played nine times and she's played four different games. Bernard has played six times, but he's only played three different games. Bill has played three times, but he's only played two different games. So it's the count of four and the count of three and the count of two that I'm after in my pivot table. Okay, let's see how this can be done. So I'm gonna click somewhere in the data. I'm gonna to go to the insert tab on my ribbon, then to the pivot table button. I'm gonna place the pivot table on this sheet in E2. And what you must do is click on this option, add this data to the data model. If you don't tick that, you're not gonna get the option for this unique count. So I'm gonna click on OK, and I'm gonna add the names to the rows area of the pivot table. Now, if I drag game into values, it will perform a count. And this is essentially the number of games they've played. So Babs has played nine times but she's only played four different games. Bernard has played six times, but he's only played three different games. So how do I perform that count of unique records? Well, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna drag game into the values area a second time, but this time I'm gonna right click in the column. Then I'm gonna to go to summarize values by and select distinct count. And that gives me the count that I'm after. Okay, that's all I wanted to cover in this particular video. Hopefully that's useful. If it is, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe, and I'll see you next video.